Today we're going to be playing low key. As one may see, my rank as killer is um, amazing. It is evident that I don't play this game, or no, I do play this game, but I don't play killer like at all. I'm a complete survivor main, but that doesn't mean I don't know the little scummy tricks to do with uh, to do with uh, killer. And because I don't play this killer, I actually lack a whole lot of perks. We've got bitter murmur. We got Sloppy Butcher, you know, that's it's okay. We got Iron Grasp for some reason. And then we have uh, No One Escapes Death. I'm also going to be using add-ons that makes me reappear quickly. I'm going to be playing really, really scummy as the Wraith. It's going to be amazingly. It's going to be amazing. And I also have crossplay turned off. So we can only be mashed up against PC players. So we can see their rage and their sweat and their salt and their everything. And we can just lick it all up. All right. Well, let's search for a match. I'll see you there. So I actually get extremely nervous and anxious when I play killer and that's because you know 1v4 it's not a it's not the greatest of odds you can't see me hello I have eyes yes I do have them and okay well you're down all right so this is where we're gonna get real scummy guys this is where we're gonna get real real scummy so we're gonna put her on this hook and then something to know with Wraith, I'm going to immediately walk away, stealth, and stand still. So, I am completely invisible, right? So, so no, so, so, so no one knows that I'm right. Oh, here we go. See? <laughs> and back to the hook you go. <laughs> What an idiot! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's go back and hang. Her. Yep, back to the hook. You go. <laughs> and that's a kill. Okay. So we're just gonna put her here and we're gonna just run away and pretend to run away. And then we're just going to remain in place. So we're completely safe and we can look around. You can look around, you just can't move. It seems like the kill the survivors know exactly what <laughs> Yeah, she's just <laughs> Like this tactic, it's great. <laughs> I'm coming for you. I'm gonna respect the pallet. Honestly, she kind of killed herself there. I could have lunged for it, but how am I supposed to know? Okay. We'll go through all the pallets. That's fine. So you just you decide death. That's fine. <laughs> no decides to strike because I don't see anyone being the thingy. Yeah, I'ma just grab my stuff and leave. Oh, interesting. And back down you go. You know what? I don't know if that was that wasn't deliverance because she didn't unhook. She just literally got three percented. What the freak? And she killed herself. Now it's whoever finds the hatch wins. And she found the hatch and he escaped. So we got three out of four. Now let's see the responses. <laughs> they need to fix this stupid UI. Oh, there we go. Okay, so we got a little bit of salt. Not too much salt, but we still got a little bit of salt. I think that went. <laughs> you guys can understand the strategy now. 
Okay, so let's talk about the strategy here. The strategy, the strategy, is essentially find one person, put them on the ground, hook them, and then walk away, pretending pretend to walk away while going invisible, and then stand still. It's okay if the hooked person can see you, as long as it, see you standing still and camping, as long as um, that person is not with another teammate, then they can't really deliver that message, so there's no way to deliver it. Which automatically, because you know what most survivors do is they typically run and try to save the person. But of course, that's exactly what we want. Why find people when you can just have them come to you? right i do one effort right one percent effort 99 percent just laziness i just put that person on the hook and just wait for them to come to me and then i bring them all down and that's what's really toxic about this strategy we're going to continue this strategy and hopefully we can get some more responses and saltiness let's get going okay coal tower this is not a good map for me because it is very very big we have found our first victim. And our second victim. Okay. So we got this guy. We're going to hook him, and then we're going to do the little, uh, tactic. Now, this time there's actually a wall there, so we can- so she doesn't know that we left. Or we stayed. Now we're just gonna wait. It's okay. We're gonna go we're gonna actually like chase her down and like completely focus her. And we got her. She needs to be faster. And let's hook her. Yeah, I, I can literally see you. All of you. <laughs> and she's dead, I think. No, this is her. No, she's dead. Yeah, yeah. This is our third hook. Gotcha, bitch. You know, she wasn't struggling. And this is why you should always struggle, right? And she's our next target. Let's just chase her down. Nope. <laughs> Victim. Okay, so we know the other person's at the generator over there. <laughs> I 
I'm sorry. You're going right back on the hook. <laughs> I didn't camp this time. Hello. <laughs> you coming straight for me. I see. I like that. <laughs> time for back on the hook. And she's dead on the hook, actually, this time. Oh, you know what? You know what? She, she I, I think she told me she wants to be on this hook. That's why she came up here. <laughs> this time, you guys got to focus on generators. Not whatever else you guys are doing. <laughs> now it's your turn. Yes, yes. Altruism is gonna be your biggest weakness. Humans get this far not through altruistic reasons, but through selfish ones. <laughs> what are you doing there? <laughs> <laughs> Time for you. <laughs> pick up, pick up. <laughs> There's a hook with your name on it. <laughs> it's just for you. <laughs> Wait, I have a better idea. I have a better idea. If she struggles, I'll kill her. <laughs> Quitter bonus. Oh no. <laughs> this is exactly what I was my plan. My plan wasn't to put my plan wasn't to give the last person the free hatch to escape. My plan was to bring him to the hatch, drop them near the hatch, and then close in front of them and then pick them up and throw in the hook. Unfortunately, that guy DC'd. <laughs> I mean his name is literally Crybaby. <laughs> You're the reason people stop playing this game. Wait. It's just like Smite. Nah, what do I care? <laughs> you all can you all can quit. I don't care. This is my enjoyment and my enjoyment alone. Okay, um, I hope you guys all enjoyed. Uh, that was interesting. <laughs> I had a lot of fun, okay? There's gonna be a lot of people who said who are gonna say, Oh, that's not fun, that's not how you play the game. I think I can play the game however the hell I want to. Isn't that great? The freedom of choice. I will not be playing Killer too much because, first off, I have no perks for Killer. Second off, I'm incredibly anxious and nervous playing Killer. It's it's just kind of unfun dealing with four brains because, like, you know, it's a 1v4 mechanic and I'm not, I'm not really interested in that. I like playing as a survivor because my odds of playing better is higher than Killer. Um, but <laughs> I'll still play Killer. If you guys want me to, of course, I will force myself to do it. It's not like it's it's not like I'm completely not enjoying it because I was enjoying that moment. It's just the fact that the starting and the, the the push I need is some kind of like I need some kind of incentive. But if you guys want me to play any killer, I'll show you guys right now the killers I have available and you guys let me know what you guys want to see. Um and uh, please leave in the comments below if you have any suggestions of what I should do on Survivor or Killer. It means a lot to me because the because if you guys give me an idea, I can make it as a video and more content, etc., etc. Hope you guys all enjoy it, and I'm gonna see you guys all low-key and non-low-key players next time. Hey, low-key players exist in this game. We got Legion, and then we got the Wraithy. We got this little Wraithy boy over here with the person who likes to skip leg day a lot. Man, he he really has those thin legs though. All right. Peace, guys.